Hi, my name is Brett. I'm here to tell you about why my hometown, Brighton and Hove, is the best place to live. What better place to start than our world famous Brighton Pier? You can't come here without playing on the Dolphin Dolphin. They also have the cheapest shops in town. This is the boundary where Brighton meets Hove. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, I'm sure it's a big green donut and here's ours. This was the once magnificent West Pier, which unfortunately closed in 1975. You can't afford the flight to India to see the Taj Mahal, you can always come here. Apparently according to Queen Victoria, bathing and sea water is good for you. There's only one way to find out. Come on! There's a whole host of other entertainment for you to enjoy. We've got our very own race course. Dog track. Three cinemas, four casinos, there's not one, but there's two universities. Over 100 places of worship, 280 restaurants, 30 nightclubs, 310 different pubs. Cheers. What better way to end the night than a calorie test for that? Funny buster. <laughs> This is our other venue in the dome where Waterloo made out of a famous in the 1974 Eurovision Song Contest. Well, it's enough. It's being one thing. I'm at the at with Dean watching our rubbish team Brighton and Hove Albion lose again. But cheer up, because next year we're still we're going to be moving into our brand spanking new stadium, which is right here at Falmer. What trip to Brighton would be complete without the good old British fish and chips? Followed by the famous stick of Brighton Rock. Well, thank you for watching.